The thousands of rockets flying in southern Israel this week made a recent gift from CBN donors all the more relevant. Take a look. CBN Israel recently installed a bomb shelter at a playground in the town of Yesha, a Jewish community in southern Israel that is often targeted by rockets from Gaza, and it wasn't a moment too soon. Gil Rafua and his wife Shira like to take their children to the playground that's right around the corner from their home, and they say the new shelter is important for their kids to live a normal life. From one side, you want to let them be kids, playing, having fun, do what kids do. And there is another side. The side is always worried, always have to be on control, always have to know what's going on. So that's how we live here. It's really, it can be very quiet and suddenly a bombing. The more bomb shelters there will be, the security feeling will be, will be higher. We can go to the playground and we know there's another shelter there that we can count on. In less than a week, Hamas and other terrorists have launched some 2,000 rockets at communities like Yesha in southern Israel and beyond. Those who live in Yesha and communities close to them have less than 15 seconds to make it to the bomb shelter. We visited them a second time during this current wave of attacks. It's rough. Uh, we didn't have a lot of sleep last night. We had a lot of uh, sirens. This is the bomb shelter CBN Partners provided for the people of Yesha. During this time of constant rocket fire from Gaza, just a couple of miles away, it came at just the right time. It's a game changer for us, the people who live in Yesha. That, uh, the fact that we know it's here, it's, it's amazing. Gil suffers from PTSD due to his time serving with the police and as a medic. He says he is grateful for CBN Israel's donation of the bomb shelter and having it where his children play will give him and Shira more peace of mind the next time they hear the sirens. Well, a lot of people are talking and doing, but here you're actually here at this time. And at the end of our visit, our CBN News team experienced what it means to have a shelter nearby. You got a live one. That's how it sounds. And back outside, we saw the smoke from the Iron Dome interceptions. I don't think that I can express in words what I'm feeling now, but a big, big thank you and just a hug. You know, a hug from the heart. Uh. Having that shelter there now, I can feel more secure to send them to play. Gives a lot of relief. For us, it's a, it's a great gift. It's heartwarming to know that people are looking out for us and giving what they can. Thank you. Well, that's one practical way you can help the people of Israel. And please pray for the people of Israel in harm's way, the innocent people in Gaza, and for wisdom for Israel's leaders. Alpha.